This is my second attempt at making hinges for the swing out ramp on this trailer. I've got a little bit of work done in that regards already, but I'm a ways off from testing. So previously I did not have this plate spot welded in place. There's another one on the bottom and I'm doing a similar thing over here. So the idea is to move the hinges away from the ramp and the trailer with the idea that when the ramp is in the open position that there will be more of a gap between the, the ramp and the trailer itself allowing more room for uh, movement. This rod is actually just temporary. I'm using it to line up the hinges from one side to the other. And if the uh, hinges are not in line, then I think it can cause binding. So I'm trying to minimize that. So I did a bit of welding. It should be enough to easily hold it in place for testing. So I don't know yet what's gonna happen. Okay, see what happens. Okay, so that's actually plenty of room now. That actually increased it a lot. That's <laughs> a pretty heavy duty looking hinge. So it actually makes the fold-out ramp longer, in a sense. Like when it like when it extends out, it's it's as though it's longer because of this gap, and that actually reduces the the angle down. So like when it's shorter, then it has to tilt down more. I was doing some testing to see how the ramp folds up and right at, right at the end see it doesn't want to close all the way this end seems better does not it seems to be less resistance here so what I think is happening here right here weld looks a little bit shiny right there and this weld I don't think is quite as high in this area but it may be interfering as well so what I think when this part here swings around I think it binds as it contacts that weld So these hinge pieces, they're all welded on two sides. This one, for example, is welded here and then on the back side. And this one is welded here and then on the back side. When I went to close the uh, ramp and close it, then it was uh, not quite closed and it was binding. And the bolts, they're not too tight. 
little bit snug, but I think that'll work. And here I can see it's uh, rubbing. Like, see on this this plate here, when this one turns, and it's uh, rubbing on here. So this one, this one, this one. So see, I can press down here a little bit, and there's a there's a piece right in there that's actually where where it's contacting. So it may just be rocking pivoting on that point because here 